The parking at the Burlington Market Basket has certainly lightened up this past week. The easy parking and near vacant shelves are the result of striking workers protesting the firing of Market Basket CEO Arthur T. DeMoulas. and a lot of bottom lines. Back in June, Arthur T. DeMolas was forced out as CEO in a hostile takeover by his cousin, Arthur S. DeMolas. Fired CEO, Arthur T. DeMolas was replaced by finance chief, Felicia Thornton of Albertson Supermarkets and Radio Shack's chief executive, James Gooch. The change ultimately led to a move for bigger dividends for the company and lighter profit sharing bonuses for the employees. They fired our CEO and we want him back. Yeah, we Woo! I hope uh, we get the result that we want and that we are a family here at Market Basket and we are lost without our leader, ATD. Save Market Basket, help us save our company. We want IDT back. I support them, I support them. 100% and those who are responsible for this, they should be whipped. Now, warehouse workers and vendors have interrupted deliveries and store employees have taken to the sidewalks in front of their respective market basket stores to fight for the reinstatement of Arthur T. DeMolas. Market basket protesters come in all shapes and sizes. Say bring up back RDT, Sean. Even with the passionate boycott, those who choose to shop are let peacefully with their carts. This is a petition to get our CEO back, Arthur T. DeMoulis. We're just showing him that not only do all our associates care, all of our vendors care, but also all the customers care. They come from all walks of life and all over. We just had a woman that signed this from New Jersey that comes here to shop here, and, and she is disgusted in what's happening. Along with all of us are absolutely disgusted. We just want our former CEO back and get it back to the way it was. A family organization, family run, family tight, and that's all we want. We just want him back and everything will be back to normal. Unfortunately, our shelves are running bare right now because a lot of people have stepped back and want this, uh, this resolved. And we're just looking for a resolution. We're just looking for an answer. And that's something that we haven't got is an answer. And that's why we stand strong. The empty shelves and protesting aren't just about one CEO and bonus checks. It marks a changing culture in a long-standing family business. As soon as they kicked out our CEO, IDT Demoulis, we decided to follow him. We're like a family here. We all need to stick together. Customers, employees, families, friends, spread the word. Boycott Market Basket, don't shop here. And there's even talk Market Basket could be up for sale. From the Burlington Market Basket, I'm B News reporter Tad Stefanak, back to you in the studio.